show you a real simple dinner here. This is, uh, well, after my daughter's been here for the last week, Derek, and we've done a lot of things, swimming and hiking and bike riding, and um, we went on the zip lines today all day, so the sun's really got me. Whew, I'm worked. But I'm going to show you a quick dinner so everybody's happy, a little cooked food, raw food, and uh, some of the things that make it so it's actually not just simple food, but it's superfood. Okay, superfood or different types of foods that have what you would call the full mineralization complex so you can become healthy, wealthy, happy, and wise. So I'm going to show you a few things I got going here. This is my veggie. You can see the bubbles in the thing. This is my veggie sauerkraut. Watch, I'll crack the top. Hold on a second here. Let's put that right there. And Okay, no, I didn't want to go ahead and fizzle. Just fizzled a minute ago, but I'm going to show you the top of this. You can see the bubbles right there going on. And if I hit it a couple of times, see all the bubbles coming up? This is all fermentation. And fermentation is, these are daikons. Mm. Excellent. They're radishers. I use the same brew over and over and over again. You can see the purple cabbage I have in there. Brown seaweed extract, magnesium, silica, vinegar, kombucha, a little bit of sugar. And this is a ferment. Those are fermented vegetables. This is our green salad right here. Another assorted green salad with broccoli and purple cabbage, zucchini, carrots, turmeric, then we have a really good salad dressing with all our superfoods in it. We've got all different types of salad dressings that you can go ahead and look up. I'm going to show you the quick recipe here. This is the cook recipe. We've got old mung bean noodles in there. I've also got tomatoes, squash, purple onions, cumin, about maybe 25 golden berries for tart flavor a little bit of sesame oil, and some, uh, let's see, raw sachaichi oil. So let me go over some of the ingredients here. We have some purple onions. I put a full squeezed lemon in there, but I let the oils work first, The, you know, and it's on low, you can see. But we let the oils work the vegetables on very low, and then about 50, not, not even 10 minutes into it, then we go ahead and actually put the lemon in, which is the emulsifier. So the end we put in cilantro. Remember, we got a lot of raw stuff here. We got a, 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 a couple of pâtés uh, made out of raw nut seeds. This is a mucoloid salad. Looks like it's really old and stuff, but it's really <laughs> full of my salad dressings and avocados and everything you can imagine. You can see all the greens in there from the spirulina and from the blue-green algae. So I use about five drops of fulvic acid in this. Uh, I put about five drops of magnesium. I also put in about a tablespoon of silica. Um, we use set toasted sesame seed oil and the raw sachaichi oil and about a spoon of ghee. The ghee gives it a really good flavor. If you're not into the ghee, then don't use it, but it does give it a buttery flavor for transitional people. A lot of people ask me all the time for transitional videos. So this is a transitional video, at least this part. Then this is Soleil salt, organic coconut aminos. This is like one of the, the secrets on everything. <laughs> it's made from coconuts and it's actually a soy sauce alternative. This is the cumin that we have. These are big mushrooms that I cut up, shiitake mushrooms. Here's the golden berries, brown seaweed extract. Um, here's some old mung beans. Remember, anything that's old you can use. It's all legal. It's going into a, a fried system here anyways, or, or cooked. These are squash, and these are older tomatoes that have a little bit of vinegar smell to them. So that's my cooked food diet, and uh, I, that's probably about 20% of my diet tonight. But it's going to go ahead and flavor uh, some, some other guests that we have here so everybody doesn't feel that they're so out of place. Um, okay, it smells so good in here. And you can actually finish it off with... Uh, pumpkin seeds right here 
And uh, you can use, uh, here's my part of my hummus that we, uh, I have every night. I always have hummus. And um, some of this yeast, which is really good too. It's a, a brewer's yeast, which is full of B vitamins and stuff. So, okay, that's it. Boy, am I whooped. And you heard the bell go off over here. We have some quinoa bread that I'm going to toast up. And you can see him right here. See them? They're pretty, uh, they smell pretty good. So it gives everybody a little bit of flavor of what's going on. And I'm going to put some, uh, some coconut oil on some of them and some ghee butter on another. And a few pieces of... Uh, of uh, raw cheddar cheese without any uh, hormones. <laughs> okay, and that's it. And this is one of our, like I said, salad dressings. And we also have another green salad dressing that we uh, have that um, is full of wasabi and this hot oriental mustard. Let me show you this before we sign off. This stuff is really, really good to put in uh, things to be able to make them flavor more sort of Asian. So. Okay, that's it. And you can see I buy the uh, soy sauce alternative in the gallon jug at Earth Shift. Um, this is my Earth Shift kitchen right here. You can see it, uh, all the different products that we got going here. My kombucha brewing over there in the corner. And coconuts, and that's it. Okay, time to eat dinner. Aloha. <laughs> we'll see you later. Bye. Important reminder, all information and ideas are for informational purposes only and are in no way intended as medical advice or as a substitute for medical counseling. EarthShift Products, Dr. Robert Kassar, all of their partners, affiliates, and subsidiaries will not be held accountable for the use or misuse of the information presented therein. This information is not intended as medical advice. The authors, publishers, and speakers of this work are not medical doctors and do not recommend the use of mineral deficient foods, drugs, or medicines to achieve beauty and to alleviate health challenges. Because there is always some risk involved, all persons involved with the development and distribution of this information are not responsible for any adverse effects or consequences of any kind resulting from the use or misuse of any suggestions or procedures described on our website or Earthshift Live radio talk show or therein.